rise above our fear again. Let us sing a song of cheer again. Happy days are here again. Hi friends, this is Fire on Pop. And uh, this video is uh, my, just as I titled it, WOW 2000 subscriber giveaway. And uh, I'm really happy. Now, a, a little background, I was ready about a month or so ago. I was really approaching uh, my 2000. I was watching that daily. And uh, all of a sudden, as most of you, I'm sure, experienced, uh, you go on YouTube and uh, poof, a ton of subs just went away, just like that. And uh, was kind of disappointing. So, not a problem. We just started the countdown again. It wasn't bad. It was uh, about a month or so now. And uh, here we are. We've just today reached my 2,000 subscribers. And I just want to say a big thank you uh, to all those who've uh, had the faith and confidence in me to, to subscribe to my channel and to watch the videos. Um, I really enjoy doing them. Um, and uh, it, it seems like by the responses I'm getting, you enjoy at least most of them, okay? I've gotten some comments that uh, weren't nice, but uh, that's always to be expected on, on uh, YouTube. Now, <coughs> contest. Uh, very simple. Let me go over what you have to do to enter this contest first, okay? All I want is a simple video. And the video, um, I want you to show me your oldest gun guns okay that you're really proud of just your chance to kind of show off your older guns you may have done a review on at one time but uh, uh, you, you know here's your chance uh, as a response video to this uh, giveaway to kind of show them off again tell me why you bought them why you like them uh, how they fire today uh, do you carry it do you just is it just a uh, a safe uh, jockey and uh, take it out once in a while when you go to the range. Anyway, tell me all about your older rifles. Now, uh, I've shown you pretty much all of mine as I've bought them, uh, but there's one that you've never seen. And I'm going to put that up on the screen right now. An 1860 Harper's Ferry. Now, this rifle uh, has a long uh, story behind it. My uh, my mother-in-law bought this for my father-in-law uh, just about 40 years ago. We were in an antique shop out down in uh, Pennsylvania, and uh, she saw this rifle. It, uh, it looks like it was used in the Civil War. Can't prove it. Uh, but it's been hanging over my uh, in-law's fireplace, then after they passed away, over mine uh, since. And you can see it here, uh, proudly displayed over the hutch, never even comes down. Uh, I, my wife won't even let me put gun oil on it, so, uh, and it's not rusted, uh, believe it or not, it's not rusted. So it's an 1860 Harper's Ferry, uh, and served well in the Civil War. Now that's kind of my uh, proudest gun, I don't shoot that, I don't know if it, it is even shootable, okay. Then, of course, you've seen some of my other uh, guns, and I'll show them here. There was videos done on them, uh, some of the older guns that I've just bought, and one that I just bought, which is the uh, uh, Makarov. I don't have it in my possession yet, but uh, I'll show a picture of that here as well, but uh, uh, that, that's coming. I like older guns. They have character. They have class. They're made of steel. They're not made of plastic. Um, they were built to last, not like the new guns today. And, uh, and gee, I was at the range with my son just the other week, and and he was shooting his Caltech, and we both saw something fall from the gun, and we looked on the ground, and sure enough, there was a piece of plastic from the trigger mechanism. Uh, so the gun had to go back to the manufacturer again. Anyway, I'm not going to go into a tirade about that. Uh, this is about older guns. Uh, and, and you know what? If your oldest gun is one you bought two weeks ago, brand new, out of the box, fine. You know, just make a video on that. Tell us why you like it, why you bought it, and uh, you'll be entered into the contest. I don't want to exclude anyone from this. So, uh, uh, and as a matter of fact, I'll throw this. If you don't own any guns, show me a knife. 
if you don't have any hunting or, or any specialty knives, darn it, grab a knife from the kitchen and show it to me and tell me about it, okay? Um, is that a deal or what, okay? I'm, I'm trying to be very simple. I'd like to see lots of responses, and I'd like to be able to give away these three prizes, okay? So the first place prize is going to be kind of unique. It's a, uh, it's going to, there's three items with each level of prize. And the first place prize is going to get a Kershaw Bear Hunter 2. I'll picture that here. A Kershaw Bear Hunter 2 along with a Remora holster of your choice. Just have to tell me what kind of gun you carry or which gun you want the holster for and I will ship that to you. And uh, the third thing you will get is an SDK 100 self-defense keychain. Uh, so those three things will go out to the first place prize winner. Now second and third place prizes are the same thing. Okay, It's a Spydeco Kiwi. I'll show that here. A Spydeco Kiwi. You know, all these knives are brand new out of the box. Um, and that's going to be uh, one of the prizes. The second will be again a Remora holster, and the third will be an SDK 100. So uh, you have prizes for first, second, and third. Now I'm going to draw this contest. Uh, let's see. I wanted to do it uh, on tax day, April 15th, but that may not be enough time. So we'll take it to the end of April. So April, the end, whatever the last day of April is, 30th to 31st. Uh, that's the day I'll do the drawing. That'll end the contest the next day on May 1st. I will do the drawing um, and announce the winners. And uh, so, um, because there's knives involved, any other rules to the contest that I think of uh, could be uh, that you have to be over 18 or have to have a written permission from your parents to send you the knife. And uh, um, you know what? Wherever you are in the world, that's fine. I have worldwide subscribers. Uh, I hate to exclude them from this contest, so uh, I'll include them in. If there's anything else I forgot to mention, I will scroll it as I'm uh, chatting with you now, okay? So those are the rules. That's what you need to do. A quick video. It doesn't have to be long. Mention my name in the video, please. Say fire on pop. And I am going to put one other requirement for the winners. The three winners of this contest, I would like to see an unboxing when I send you the prizes, and I would like to see you use the Remora holster in your first impressions, if it is your first impressions, and if not, how you, what do you think of the Remora holster. So, uh, that's kind of after the fact, but I'm going to put it as a requirement, so if you win the prize, I'm going to expect to see a, an unboxing with uh, a demo of the Remora holster. Okay, can't hold you to that. Just thought it would be a nice thing to do since the people at Remora are uh, providing the holsters free of charge. Okay, uh, hope to see many entries. Thank you again for subscribing to my channel. It's been fun. We hope to continue right along making more and more videos. Hope to get out to the range more and more now that the weather, the weather is getting better. So, uh, be safe out there my friends. This is Fire on Pop. Be safe and God bless. Bye now. This is Fire on Pop and I approve of this message. So long sad times, so long sad times, we are rid of you at last. Howdy gay time, cloudy great time, you are now a thing of the past. Sing a song of cheer again. Happy days are here again.